hello welcome back today we're going to be watching this scene from orange county no new york excuse me this is from new york um this is aviva throwing her leg <laughs> i mean obviously she has a, a prosthetic leg but what would that be considered using a weapon <laughs> I I don't watch New York. Um, don't know who Aviva is. I did watch all of their taglines, so I've seen some of them based on that, but no idea who this is. Um, but let's get into it. Stands that everybody isn't just gonna forgive and forget after just a few weeks. I mean, everyone's feeling Aviva is a bit toxic. And I think all of us at the table think that there are much bigger issues that you're not facing. There's got to be deeper issues okay. than just alcohol. What about. issues? I just think that there's a laundry list. And I think that you need to be honest with yourself about some of the things that I think you try to cover up and crutch with other things. That's what, what I'm talking about, about Heather. There's not asthma going on here. This is exactly. more than asthma. And do you know what? Like, I've done nothing but trying to be your friend this whole time. No, you have actually been a horrific person to me. Just so you know. Oh, okay, so you're not. Just so you know. Okay. okay. You have not been a friend to okay, me. Okay, perfect. So now you're the most horrible person to everybody here. I think. Okay. I, I kind of see why she's gonna. Is I'm assuming Aviva is the one everybody's talking to. Okay, I, I kind of see why she's gonna <laughs> end up throwing something at them. Why are they all yelling at her at once? Y'all know I hate that. Like, why does everybody have to yell at her at once? <laughs> Trust issues. I think okay, people feel that you're not a truthful person and what you didn't want to go on the trip because you, you claim you have asthma and no one really you're believes you as okay. asthma. I understand your position. She didn't go on the trip because she had fact, asthma? <laughs> I've been lied to. My doctor lied to me. My doctor told me I have asthma so severely that I couldn't go to Montana. She lied? Hey, wait. Let's you all believe it. You all believe it. Hey, let me let me She's okay. giving that five minutes. Yeah. I want She's five making minutes. fun of okay. it. This is not my chest. Give me a break. Wait, what's going on? <laughs> I mean, look at this. It even has my name on it. Can you believe my doctor forged this x-ray? No, I don't is believe that a it. Man? Okay, you know. I don't know. So much that they made me take medicine. She seems like it's a liar, like, huh? so never mind. Is that a joke? She's not funny. <laughs> she seems Nobody crazy. Knows what she's talking about. Those are lungs for Botox. Oh. Carol is saying that I wasn't being truthful about my asthma. No. I'll tell you what. Do me a favor, okay? Now call the doctor. Find out what it is. Not the no, doctor call numbers. The doctor. Ask him yourself. I mean, give me a break. I mean, this is just ridiculous. The only who are close to you are trying to peg me as a liar is because it's the only way around the fact that I heard things about your writing. Oh, shut the f*** up. I don't have to defend my career to you anyone else. It's so weird. No, 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 it's too weird. There are no two sides to Aviva. There's just one side to Aviva. And she's so... Maybe she is crazy. I feel bad. I feel bad. How could asthma prevent you from going on a trip? I mean, Montana is in the mountains, and I don't know. I guess since it's up there, it's. It, I mean, it's different. The air is different. I've been to Colorado a few times, and I mean, it, it is quite different. The air is different up there. Um, I don't know, maybe, but I mean, I know people, people in my family had asthma and they went and they were fine. So I, I don't know. That just doesn't sound like a legit reason to not go on a trip because you have asthma. Like what? I don't think those are appropriate. I really believe the deeper issue is you didn't want to leave your husband for five days. which I understand. Oh, cause he be cheating. Not an illness. Wow. This is bad comedy. 
Okay, now she's being dramatic. How do you lose 10 pounds in, unless you have an intestinal Because I'm trying to eat well to get rid of the reflux, to get rid of the asthma. Because the cause of the asthma is not mold, it's not anxiety, it's not food allergies, it's reflux. And okay, Kim. And rid of reflux, you have to eat as a special. Okay. No, is she the Kim of the show? <laughs> Just making up ridiculous okay. lies. Oh, I thought that was the last. <laughs> documents she gave the doctor's number she, she i mean she had all of her receipts and they were still acting like she was lying but i if you really thought she was lying that bad y'all should have just called a doctor at the table or something so i don't know i mean they're all trying to make her seem like she's crazy i'm not gonna lie not being able to go on a trip because of asthma does sound a little crazy <laughs> it really does um but Aviva is very convincing. <laughs> she bought all of her receipts. So, I mean, I don't really know what to believe. Y'all, I don't know. I guess the reason I'm having a hard time believing it is because it's giving Kim. Like, <laughs> like Kim, y'all know Kim from Atlanta. She come up with the most ridiculous reasons as to why she can't go on a trip. So, that sounds a little ridiculous to me. <laughs> I don't, but she could be telling the truth. Again, like, she bought all of her receipts and stuff. I don't know. Y'all tell me if she was telling the truth or not. Leave that down below because I'm confused. She was very convincing. But yeah, that was uh that was funny. <laughs> Those were my thoughts. What were your thoughts? Leave them down below. Make sure you like and subscribe, and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.